I'm good. How are you? Are we I'm matching right. tonight? Yeah, we look good. <laughs> well, you look amazing. Thank you. Simon, this is such an exciting finals. I mean, the show is just incredible, but we have incredible singers as well. So I wanted to know, out of the singers in the finals, if you could see any of them on your label. We're going to have to wait and see. <laughs> the good thing now with these shows, because we're so... There's so many people who watch it, even offline, you know, online, I should yeah. say, outside of watching the show, that you start to get an idea who people want to see signed, who could sell records. Uh, but they were really good, the singers tonight. And then the normal singers were good tonight. I mean, everyone was great. Everyone so, was great. Oh, America's got a very hard, very hard choice to make. Yeah, I'm glad I'm not voting. <laughs> yeah. And your boys, pretty much, they came up with a new song. Yeah. So how proud are you to see them? I mean, they're incredible. Thank you. I mean, it's the start of their career. I mean, you know, you've got to work hard. You know, you've got to build up fan bases. But they're really nice guys. They're very appreciative. Um, and I think they're incredibly talented. Uh, so yeah, I've got a good feeling about them. Look, I love doing the shows and I love my artists on the label, so I, I, I'm a lucky person. Amazing. These people have been through such an incredible journey. Yes. Tomorrow is the end. However, their careers are just gonna bloom and, and you know, grow from here. This yes. is a stepping stone. And not only the winner will have a great chance, you know, I think that a lot of people, and Simon said it before, a lot of people actually don't win that million dollar. You know, they sometimes have even better careers. Yeah. So people should not like give up their dreams and hopes just because they don't win tomorrow you know exactly but I mean this season has been so incredible everyone's saying that the top 10 is possibly the best that we've seen so far yes. so why do you think that I mean people just get better and better as the years and, go on and where have all these people hiding <laughs> yeah. that were here this season where were they before I really don't know maybe you know sometimes when they do the auditions and that day they had to go to work or whatever or was too far for them to drive you just never know yeah. or maybe they were too afraid to participate in the years before because literally this year was like where are all these people coming from and how come in the four years I've been sitting here they've never come like what's <laughs> yeah. up with that yeah they were waiting for their moment and their time and that was now yeah <laughs> and they really worked it out otherwise they wouldn't be here in the finale exactly yeah. but Heidi I love seeing the four of you together you're so funny there's the you know Simon and Mel B and Howie and all what do you love most about judging with the, the three that they're all all so different and at, at the end of the day we all have each other's back you know even though when grumpy and grumpy are kind of fighting with each <laughs> grumpy other and grumpy. grumpy and grumpy fighting with each other they still love each other yeah. at the end of the day yeah. you know sometimes it's just fun too for them to like get at each other yeah. when we're live on TV and no one can take anything you know <laughs> whatever yeah. is said they can't take it back no it's out there yeah awesome honey thank you so much and good luck to America for voting yes. do the right thing America go with your gut <laughs> But Mel, what an incredible final, the top 10. Oh, gotcha. Your golden buzzer is an obvious standout, so well, how are you I, feeling? I think she is, but I mean, tonight was such a variety show, which was jam-packed of talent. Yeah. I would have a hard time choosing. Obviously, I would go with my golden buzzer, but what an amazing show. Incredible. Possibly the best top 10 we've had on America's Got Talent up to date. Well, I say that every year, yeah. so I don't want to sound like a stuck <laughs> record, but I do say that every year. But Mel, it was brilliant. Brilliant, but if you had to choose, besides your golden buzzer... No, it would be my golden buzzer. I can't choose. <laughs> well, thank you. I'm, this is not interesting for you? <laughs> no, I'm saying you've got to keep it interesting, oh, yeah, as right. always. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But let's talk about the kids, Howie. I mean, they've been phenomenal from the very beginning. We've got three in the final now. It's almost like you guys could actually do uh, America's Got Talent Kids, a spin-off show? I think they have. Have they done an America's Got Talent Kids in year two? I think they did that. I I think they did. Out. I think they did, but it is a good idea. But NBC does little big shots, so they don't need for us to do it. And what I love about what we do here is the variety. So there are kids, there are troops, there's you know somebody eight competing against somebody sixty-eight. That's the beauty of what America's Got Talent is. It should never just be one thing. Yes. And tonight you told us a bit about Preacher, how you can relate, but especially now having comedy in the finals, how, how awesome is that for how you to see? It's so wonderful. It kind of, uh, you know, uh, it makes, you know, I always feel that uh, the, as a comic we are the unappreciated art form because people just think you just show up and you talk, but a lot of thought goes into what you're saying, how you say it, and a lot of fear goes into the fact of whether people are going to receive it well, and he was received well. And looking at him, is there any kind of advice that you'd like to give him now? Hopefully in eight weeks somebody picks him up, but any kind of advice you'd give him moving on in his career? No, I think that he's just got to keep doing what he's doing. And as long as he does what he's doing and he owns it and he believes it and he loves it and doesn't work for other people, it'll keep working. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Exactly. Well, thank you so much, Howie. Nice to see you. Hi, my name is Heidi Klum and you have just been buzzed.